Hello everyone, Namaste. Today I want to speak uh, a little bit about the post-traumatic experience that um, we are going through at this time because uh, humanity as a collective, um, especially within those that uh, are into the ascension process for quite some time now, everybody is, but there are those of us who are really more in the know as a first uh, wave ascension and uh, everything else follows so so the deeper we go into our, uh, uh, our ascension process uh, the more we discover uh, things to be cleared out and this particular subject has to do about the time of Atlantis uh, the time uh, that uh, this is the fifth time that humanity is uh, going through this process uh, to to rise above in the vibrations and it is already victory of light it's just that uh, for the first time in our existence as humanity we are going now uh, through a very deep cleansing that has to do with the time of Atlantis the time that uh, we uh, destroyed ourselves so there's a lot of trauma within our uh, our uh, collective uh, psyche that needs to be released so if you feel uh, this uh, some kind of when you go into your meditation you feel this energy you feel some kind of um, difficulty uh, in this in this time space reality it is because of that and, and this needs absolutely the time to go within so it's not about uh, taking uh, distracting ourselves and going and do other things like eating foods and anything it's very important to go through the process personally individually in order to release it because it's it doesn't say it takes so much time it is not ours it's not mine it's not ours so it's something that that we we can release with a breathing and yesterday actually I want to share this with you or yesterday I was um, I'm doing this this very powerful breathing for the moment it, it's um, Patricia Alcotta Robles is was sharing this in uh, on her uh, channel, so I'm gonna share this with you also now. Uh, and it goes like uh, we breathing, breathing in, holding it for a while, and exhaling, and holding it for a while. But then while you do that, we, we I, I say, we say, I say, um, um, I inhale God's pure oxygen. I hold it. I assimilate God's pure oxygen and I exhale. I exhale God's pure source oxygen and I expand God's pure source oxygen. Again, inhaling, I inhale God's pure source oxygen. I assimilate God's pure source oxygen. I expand. Exhale, sorry, exhale, God's pure source oxygen, and I expand God's pure oxygen. So when when you do this, um, at the same time uh, we can do this for whole humanity. So when I say these words, I am, I am presence, and I am one with I am presence of every person on earth. Then we have. Uh, the uh, higher self of each and every on the planet assisting in this so we are helping also each and every on the planet so 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 by by doing this 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 sacred breathing seven times so counting seven times then uh, we also assist the collective and yesterday while I was doing this breathing I uh, I felt the I was feeling the energy inside of me like like something that is it's like there and I felt really like a electricity going through my body and I, I, as I was doing this breathing then boom the energy was gone so I was like wow you know this is this is exactly that, that we are learning to to use the breathing to release even the traumas from 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 uh, from the time of Atlantis how do you how do I know this about the time of Atlantis because there is a very very uh, a nice channeler Brenda Hoffman that is I'm sharing this on my website that is talking about this and it makes sense because it's the first time that we, we um, uh, as a collective, we, we have gone so far into our ascension process. We have gone so high in the energies 
that, that it's time now for us to, to go also deeper and clear even this part of us, which is in, its, in turn, it also reflects outside. So, so, so the fact that we are dealing within, it also brings out more of atrocities to be seen out in the world because the light, that's what it does. First, it's working within. So where we go one, we go all. So when one does the work, then it also works for the whole collective. And at the same time, the collective is also experiencing and seeing things that were not seen before. So the light, this is the way the light works. And this brings me to the next subject that for the next four months, it's going to be a lot of information, a lot of, a lot of truth coming out. So this is not about scaring anybody, it's about preparing you to hold the light and um, and very important also is about to not um, hold these emotions of, of, of fear, of pain within, but to see them and then to release them and then we can release them through through playing music, through dancing, through painting, through creating art, through to, through we're doing all kinds of activities and this is actually being the light on the planet for those that are not are not there yet so we can we can show them the way to be always in the high vibration and so i am having here now my digits my dj set ready i'm gonna be doing a, a dj session in the next uh, in the, my next video uh, it's on. It's everything at 432 hertz. It's house music, and uh, so if you like to have a little bit of dancing, if you like house music, I love house music, and um, if you like to dance a little bit and have this energy move out of your body, uh, we will do like a small breathing in the beginning, like a inhale, exhale, seven times, and then we can go into it, and I will play for half an hour, and then. And then you can also participate in this and, and do the work uh, at your home whenever you like. It works. It's like we, we go into these frequencies of, of dancing of higher frequency and that's how we also release. It's very important first to go within and to release this, to see it for what it is and then to release it. And then as you do that, as we uh, raise a frequency then then it's something that we can learn to do it more often because we are love and light we are nothing less than that and then and then all of us and and uh, it's it's an honor to be here on the planet at this time each and everyone is on the planet everyone even all the eight billion people on the planet each and everyone is has been chosen to be in this time space reality to be here in the now why have been chosen 8 billion of us to be on the planet? Because, because um, uh, Mother, Father, God uh, uh, saw uh, in us as a soul the ones that they are more capable to go through the process of ascension. So this is the first time and this is an honor that, that we are being in this time, especially being on the planet. And this is something that is the most valued experience in the whole universe, in all cosmoses. This is amazing news that is also shared by Patricia Codrobles that I also shared on my website. You can go and uh, check uh, her last video on my website. And, 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 and this, is, this is incredible. I mean, we, also, we already know this, but in the whole cosmos, we have the galactics and we have everybody out there watching us and assisting us. And then we are here in these bodies the boots on the ground doing the work and and that that is amazing and that also it's something that you also need to be aware of this and to celebrate ourselves and not to just uh, uh, be uh, too much into what is coming to the surface right now it has to be seen it has to be acknowledged and then and then go inside and find the frequency within to raise a frequency because this is what we're here for we're here to ascend within our physical bodies okay within our physical bodies it means the information is coming out we have celeste chambers med beds that can heal each and everyone people from 80 for 90 for 100 years old they can go back reverse the lives and go back to 30 years old 20 years if they want and, and each one of us, this rejuvenation. So this is the ascension process. We are going through this through our bodies, but also we have we are becoming galactic. So this is all 
interrelated, it's all connected and we don't see it yet out there but it's really coming forward. So much news happening, so much is happening behind the scenes that I, I, I mean there is a lot of information out there. I don't, I'm not gonna go into this for now. The important thing is to wherever we are, wherever we stand in, in, in our ascension process it's always very important to find the peace within and to go and and find the way within that is like raising a frequency even in the smallest of activities if it's like washing our dishes or making food or or, or taking care of uh, children uh, or working it's all, always about presence it's always about staying in alignment with uh, with the higher self and this can be done very easy with the, the breathing I just shared with you Okay, so in the next video I'm going to be sharing um, this breathing in the beginning of the session and then I'm going to play some music for you. I hope you enjoy and much love and namaste.